good day and welcome to another weekly update episode 24 yes if i'm not mistaken how are you guys doing have your week be um everything i hope you guys are surviving working hard to be able to uh, go through the trade of life <clears throat> So by the way, uh, this week update is not something that is going to be much. Actually, I missed some day now because we have done some stuff and we sent them out. I was not around, so I didn't get to like make this weekly update and film. But some of them, the picture, I will try as much as possible to put the picture in this week update. So how are you guys doing? I will be showing you some stuff now I'm looking at like some we are working on and some we've done and we've sent out like sure i said earlier that we'll be putting the picture so <laughs> how are you guys doing so uh thank you guys for watching thank you guys for being here uh, i appreciate you guys for staying tuned by god grace by god grace there are a lot of tutorial video interesting video that will be coming sooner very very soon we are working on that we are just trying to like fix where we'll be making the video so that we we'll bring out good content for you it won't be as if now we just want to post video we'll try as much as possible to create good content but i want this uh weekly update to complete before we stop and try new things but if you want me to stop you can leave in the comment section below if you find something interesting at least in the weekly update if you always find something that is good and you learn from it let me also know so it's your comments and your votes will also determine for us to stop or to continue so if we don't have video that is educative uh, to the extent for you to learn we'll not be posting but if we have we'll be posting so that's just it so if you are new to this channel for those of you who are new who have not subscribed please consider <laughs> take this time to subscribe and when you subscribe make sure to turn on the post notification bell so that you get notified so for those of you who have been here who are watching who always watch our video and stay tuned to the time we'll be uploading thank you guys we really appreciate you guys leave in the comment section as always and give this video a giant thumbs up as you can see there are some bags and by the way those bags soon I'll be doing a giveaway, I, but I don't know how I'm going to do it because the rates of exchange now is very high. And for someone that is not within Nigeria to pick, that is going to be a problem. And I want this giveaway to go around to all my subscribers because I have all I have subscribers. I, I have subscriber for different region of the world, or let me say different continent of the world, different country. So, and I will want this giveaway not to be within my country, only to go out to everyone. So, but I'm still thinking of what to do. Or maybe if I do some measurements, some part-time, some of my book, that may be within... Okay, the bag may be within, the, within my own country, then outside country will be for the book and some items that, uh, that won't take me much to send. So, that's just it enough talking let me turn the camera and show you some what we are up to <laughs> for the week and what we have been doing so far thank you guys for watching see you later so by the way when i was not when i was not around uh that place there are some bags that are there that are stored there i already take them out to uh, our vendor and we make some so we've packaged them like the one on top those are traveling bag uh, the one at the bottom again there are some laptop bag there and my own bag i'm using is also there yeah basically this is a traveling bag we make this is another one we make we make this we make this this is my own bag i'm using and this is another one at the top those are things we make and by the way we make some lunch box away as well we make this bigger one it's from uh, one of our good clients the lunch box i make last time with frame uh the woman also requested to make this particular big lunch box for her husband so it will be able to contain his food flags and all his stuff inside that's why we make it very big this way so just for one person so uh, another client of mine or let me say my customer in the market asked me to make a very portable lunch box for her daughter so this is it it's just like a customized this is not something we've made before for this and this this is a customized size because as you can see the first one okay no let me finish talking first before i will show you the measurements so the big one and the inside what do we use for the inside we use a um what is it called a blue 
a blue warmer uh -huh, something like this this is what we use for the inside of that big one a blue warmer like this so we still have some cuts that we'll be making what i wanted to do is to make three sides this smaller one then a little bit uh, a, the one that is a little bit bigger than this smaller one i'm showing you that is not even up to half of this so that's what we are trying to make it and i still have this my carry board on the decks because there's one bag i'm trying to add to the collection actually i will i didn't talk about making collection for you guys but those bags you see here those are part of the 2021 the light collection we are trying to make so when it's done i'll try as much as possible to show you guys and there are some i'm working on in my other shop that i don't vlog there and those are that that is the place most of the apprentices usually be because I asked them to leave this place for me so I can make the video if I'm making video here they normally go back there so we are working there but I will try once we are done with those work I will show you guys so you see the collection if any of you want to buy or you have anyone you like there you can leave in the comment section one is this time I will let you guys know so going back to what we are talking about so we are trying to make another launch box so the launch box will be three so this is measuring this is the cutting for that one but when we make it i will show you maybe in this video as well so we have rest of the material probably i may decide to make another launch box or something tangible to this material that is left so talking about the measurements this is the don't mind this this is what we make way back and those drawings there are for uh most of this bag as i was like explaining it to and explaining it to my uh, apprentice and showing them what we need to do so those are like uh, some structure of the cover since we have the basic measurement for all the bag so talking about the measurement for the big launch box so that is the measurement there the side of it is six and a half while the front of it is 12 and a half the height is 15 and a half then in between the undo which is in between this place is that five you are seeing there and then the strap that is starting from bottom from the bottom of the bag way to where it's top here is 44 inch as you can see that is the 44 inch which is representing the hand and the space you leave within here and here we lift we leave three inch so basically after you finish measuring this that's when you calculate the zip the zip will be from here to here so if you are making something like this, it's just a two panel the top back and the bottom that is that would be one panel then the side right the front and the side left will be another panel so that is how we achieve and make this particular launch box so again that is the measurement then for this one that is down here this particular one here this is the measurement for this small launch box as well so this small one that is the measurement at the top not the bottom one it's nine by five and a half by seven so the height of the bag is nine inch which the height is this particular side this is the height of the bag that is nine inch then the side of it is five and a half which is from here to here which is the side of it five and a half then we have seven inch which is the front side from here to here if you measure it is going to give you seven inch. so the second measurement at the bottom is the one we cut down the one i was trying to show you there so after i will make it probably i will be showing you guys but by the way uh this bigger one may not be here again by the time i will be filming the rest of the video for that one we are making because this now i'm going to take it and deliver it to the owner of the launch box so with that being said that's just it and the smaller one let me show you the material we use for the inside so this is a kind of like a texture uh material we use for back strap the inside and the inside end of a back strap so this is what we use so that is what i use for the inside of this particular small one so it's a different one since it's not the same client what they ask for is a different thing so we make it based on the specification so that's why we always ask you guys to contact us we produce back to your taste to your specification when we are making the design we try to, as much as possible to include our clients for them to decide what they want and what they don't want in the launch box as you can see this is what i'm talking about and for the bigger launch box it's different basically she didn't even uh, like choose the material so she left us with choosing of the material she just like give us the the 
sample of what she wants just like we talk about what she really wants and we talk about how big is going to be so and we take the measurement and we make it for her so this is the one i was talking about of the inside of the launch box as you can see oh, oh let me look for a flashlight so that it will be a little bit clear yeah now i've gotten a flashlight as you can see this is how neat the launch box is by the way that is just a waste uh trade so this is the launch box this is what we use for the inside and this is you see it's a very different material so those the material are both good material but it, on a different scale that one is a little bit expensive than this but this is not normal it's not usually at the market so you have to look for it it but this we always find it in the market and we have not just that we have different one with different color like this is also almost the same thing with it we also have the warmer that is reflex this is this is a little bit more expensive but if you can maintain it it's very good because it will keep your phone your food i mean pardon me your food warm at all time so that is it for this particular video we'll be showing you the rest of the activities we'll be doing in the shop and thank you guys for watching if you are new to this channel please consider subscribing when you subscribe turn on the post notification bell so that you get notified when we upload a new video for those of you who are old year our g please be sure to like this video give it a giant thumbs up if you do enjoy and leave in the comment section what you think and idea we can do on this particular channel thank you guys for watching and we'll see you on the other side so guys welcome to another day or another part of the making of the video by the way i went shopping and i got this uh vivet kind of material so we'll be using it stay tuned for the projects we'll be using it for i got some bag sitting as well sometimes if you want to buy this from the market in the bunk you won't get it so you just have to buy this smaller smaller one i got this for i think four or three type of this i got four i should have one inside as well okay yeah this is a rebit a rivet then the rest are back feet this one is silver while the remaining two are gold so that is some of the thing i get so i also bought a wax my wax i don't know what, how i misplaced it i can't find it in the shop again or maybe i took it from here to the other side to use it so this is the wax we use for uh genuine leather if you are working on it sewing with this kind of thread and by the way this thread is madly expensive so mostly we don't buy the rope so we if we want to work or i want to use it i just buy the measurement so this is this thread you will see me using it and by the way i i'm doing this because i want to like on this channel show you guys how to use genuine leather to work i've been using genuine leather to work make some wallet boards those are i uh, client wallets or maybe projects sometimes i don't have time to film or maybe if i do it at home or at the other shop so i don't have time to film and show you guys so that is the reason why i got this here so we'll be working with this you guys will be seeing how things are going so that is just it for this part so that's the little things i went shopping for so uh about few or some weeks ago we talked about this mag uh, button snap i was asking you guys if you guys do here we can get it you guys should tell me but at the end of the day none of you are replying me back so uh thank god alhamdulillah we later i later got i talked about getting uh buying the dice as well so i got the dice and at the end of the day i also got the machine so as i was saying finally we've make it as you can see this is a snap button so we later got it and this is like a hand bangle and that is the machine we i didn't show you this machine i got another one to use in this shop as you can see this is pretty expensive and i think is a product of uh what is it called nxj this is not sponsored by the way i'm just trying to show you guys it's one of the best actually you can put on any dice of yours to work with it so uh, that is it and here are some dice i also shop for this is another dice i also shop for with the machine so 
if I'm using this, I'll be showing you what this can really do. Some of it I also get. As I said, we have been up to a lot of things that I didn't get to film, and some are not even here. But I will try as much as possible to always keep you guys up the updates so that people can learn. I know guys are people are learning from this, like people that want to start the journey of their new bag making. So and some people that are pro here don't enjoy this video, but I also I always hope you guys will enjoy this video for the pro and for people that are learning newbie. Thank you guys for watching. For those who have not subscribed, let me always remind you: consider subscribing. When you subscribe, turn on the post notification bell so that you get notified when we upload a new video. Thank you guys, and we'll see you as we proceed to the rest of the weekly activities. Bye for now. So welcome to another day again in the making of see the weekly updates, the episode 24, I think so. So I've been busy lately working, doing some stuff, but don't get time. I didn't get time to vlog. So by the way, the last time I talked, we talked about most of this launch box and uh, this uh, 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 button snap. I later got and the machine that is there. So we have been working, we have been working, we have been working, we have been working, but I was not around, but work has still continued. That's the reason why I decide to always make this weekly update so that you guys get notified or updates on the things we are up to and some measurements and some bags and some projects we have been up to. So by the way, uh, apart from making this, you know, I show you when I was filming this video, uh earlier i show a size of this with a bigger one but which is not this those are two so this video you know i say we make this video throughout the week the ones i make already has been delivered to the client the big one and the smaller one so i talk about making another launch box with the rest of the material and getting another material so some people i don't know Maybe this is the time for people to order for lunchbox. People, other people contact me, contacted me and order for lunchbox again. So I decided to make this too. So those measurements are slightly the same with the one I make last time because the person that bought the first one I make with that one saw it and said she wants exactly the same thing for her daughter. So we make this and also the same clients want to make this for her husband as well to take his lunch to work so that's just it and i think this is where we'll be ending this video so if you do enjoy this video always give it a giant thumbs up consider subscribing if you are new to this channel when you subscribe turn on the post notification bell so that you get notified when we upload a new video so thank you guys all for those of you who have been here since day one and for those of you who always come back to watch video and have not subscribed yet please use this time to subscribe it costs you nothing to subscribe only things that you can even gain from us by subscribing and by the way i have uh, some of my illustration here so in the next week update that will be coming expect something like this we'll be making this we make some actually it has been delivered in the other shop we it has been delivered to the clients those are man posts but main, they are mainly for let me say toiletry bag because people that buy it from me are barbing saloon that put they sell it to their own client as well that put clipper and their uh, barbing apron with some items inside so expect that we'll be making that and i'll be showing it i'll be showing you in the next week updates how it's looking so guys as i said earlier that this is where we'll be ending the video and we shall see you next week update thank you guys for watching and bye for now